the mystique of the Jerry Curl has captivated great minds worldwide. This trend swept the nation in the 1980s and the 1990s. Many credit the creation of this magical potion to the hair care guru Jerry Redding. Now we will reveal the backstory to the secret origin of the Jerry Curl. So Ms. Hastert, tell us just how was the Jerry Curl discovered? Well, back then, Don was a plumber. So obviously anything that we need to get fixed in the house, he did it himself. One day, I was in the kitchen making my world famous potato salad for our domino tournament. I noticed that our sink was clogged. So I left a note for Don to fix it. I was the receptionist for Jerry Redding at that time. Later on that evening when I came home, Don was so excited. He had his shirt unbuttoned. He used to do this thing with his tongue. It was something like... having a moment. <sighs> anyway, I had noticed that his hair was different. Silky smooth. So curly and moist. It looks so good. I was jealous. So I asked him how he did it, and he told me he was in the drain of the sink, and when he picked his head up, he didn't have an afro anymore. He just had all of these curls. So I put my head under the sink, and I got me one, too. <laughs> and when I went to work the next day, was the new diva in town. Ain't nobody could touch me. I didn't know it at the time, but my boss, Mr. Redding, he was trying to figure out what ingredients was in my hair. And when we perfected it, Don bottled it up and gave it right to my hairstylist, Shondrika, and she sold it in her shop. We did good for a long time until that Mr. Redding stole the rug right from underness. I can't prove it, but I know that he stole some of my beloved world famous potato salad to figure out the ingredients and make his own Jerry Curl juice. And I ain't got nothing more to say about it. You just heard the testament of Donna Hastert, but there's another chapter to this story. Meet Geraldine Ali, or as her friends call her, Jerry. Greetings, Mrs. or should I say Sister Ali. Assalamu alaikum. God bless you. So, Sister Ali. Tell me what exactly is your involvement with the invention of the Jerry Curl? The name Jerry Curl did not come from old Mr. Redden. The proper spelling for it is Jerry. G-E-R-R-Y. Named after yours truly, of course. So you're saying that you actually invented the Jerry, I mean, Jerry Curl. That's exactly what I'm saying. Couldn't nobody do it like me. That's why they named it after me. Geraldine, Jerry, Jerry Curl, hello. <sighs> then that old Sean Drinker Perkins got jealous of me. You know her and Don and Donna, they went and sold their souls to the devil. Mm -hmm. Old Red. <sighs> I was bitter then. But I'm good now because I've made my journey. Took a 
journey, well, where did you go? I joined the temple, went to Mecca. I made peace and washed my hands of all those past transgressions. Hmm, I see. Well, let's just see what Mrs. Perkins has to say about your allegations. Greetings, Ms. Perkins. I'm with Backstory, and I'd like to ask you a few questions about a Miss Geraldine Ali. Who? Oh, yeah. I remember old Geraldine Ali. Late rent paying heifer. Whew. Had to get rid of her. So you're saying she wasn't even a good employee? Ha! Honey, let me tell Yeah. She think I don't know what she was doing, but I had my good eye on her from the very beginning. Okay, you want the backstory? I'm gonna give you the backstory. Our viewers are listening. I'm gonna tell you if you let me finish. One of my customers, Donna, pastor, came in my shop one day looking all fresh with her hair all slicked out. Well, after she left, everybody wanted their hair to look like that. So, a few weeks later, her husband comes in my shop with this spray bottle and says, spray it on my hair. I did. And my hair looked just like hers. So I started selling it in my shop. And the Jerry Curl is still going strong. I'm the only shop in South Central where you can still get a curl today. And there you have it. The backstory of the secret origin of the Jerry Curl. Join us next week when we explore the ancient discipline of shoe throwing.